This video is going to show you how to jailbreak and unlock your iPhone 3GS on firmware version 4.3.1. The first thing that you need to do is to download two files from the video description, the 4.3.1 firmware file for your device, and Snowbreeze. Then once you have downloaded those files, run Snowbreeze, and then click Next. Then browse for the firmware that was downloaded, then select the 4.3.1 firmware, If you have the iPhone 3GS, then a pop-up will come up, and it will be asking you if you have the old boot ROM or the new boot ROM iPhone 3GS. If you don't know which one you have, select Detect It For Me. Then click Next. Then select Expert Mode, and select General. Then you have the option to enable an animated boot logo, and you also have the option to activate your iPhone. If you don't have an official AT&T SIM card, then you need to select Hacktivate. If you do have an official AT&T SIM card, then you don't need to activate your phone. Then click Next. If you are not on one of the six baseband versions listed in the video description, then you need to select Install the iPad Baseband. Then click Next. You can choose your custom boot logo, and then click Build IPSW. And now it will take around 5 minutes to build the firmware file. Then once it's done creating the firmware file, click OK. Then make sure your iPhone is connected to the computer, and then turn your phone off. Then click Start. Press down the home and power buttons for 10 seconds. Then release the power button, but keep holding down the home button. And now your iPhone is in DFU mode. And close Snow Breeze. Now open iTunes. And then shift click on restore and select the firmware file that was created with Snowbreeze and the file name to start with Snowbreeze and then click open and now it's applying the new software to your iPhone now iTunes has finished restoring the iPhone and it's booting back up and now your iPhone will be jailbroken on firmware 4.3.1 Now to unlock your iPhone with Ultra Snow, you will need to be on one of six basebands. Those six basebands are listed in the video description. Then go to Cydia. Then go to Manage. And then Sources. And then tap on repo666.ultrasnow.com. and then tap install. Then insert your SIM card. I'm going to insert my T-Mobile SIM. and then tap on Reboot Device. If you are on T-Mobile, go to Settings, then General, and Network, and then turn Enable 3G off. And as you can see, it says T-Mobile at the top. And it's unlocked on firmware 4.3.1.